All right, this video is going to show how to hack or convert a normal push button or remote control or even a timer fog machine um, activator or switch or trigger into a trigger or activator controlled by the prop. Now the prop um, needs to have either um, a fog activator or you're gonna have to wire into one of the motors or or lights that come on when the prop turns on and when that uh, prop motor turns on or light or whatever you hook to or if the prop has a fog activator out um, it will turn on when the prop turns that on uh, if that makes any sense um, all props at least the spirit Halloween ones and Jimmy's run on five or six volts um, and what happens is with the normal spirit Halloween out of the fog um, um, trigger line it sends five volts out of the fog trigger when it wants to trigger the fog to a relay in the spirit Halloween fog trigger and then the relay turns on the uh, green and the black wire going here to the fog machine which be the center one and the one to the right when you look at this on all spirit Halloween fog machines and also on the um, other fog machines that are non spirit it's always the one in the center and to the right and the center is always green but on a few non spirit off branded fog machines the right blade here is not always black on some is white but anyway regardless of the color you want to find which one comes on this side of the switch that goes to that right one and the center is always green and you want to cut everything else out of the um, fog activator button switch or whatever you're using and all you're going to use originally out of it are the um, green and usually the black wire but on this one it was the white so I um, got the white taped up there you can see the, the white coming out of there and I just cut off the black one got to put a piece of tape around that eventually then I got a bunch of um, 5 volt relays these run off of 5 volt DC because again that's what the prop um, um, is going to send to this or if, like I say if you don't have a, uh, a fog activated just hook to a motor or a light or whatever the the prop um, um, has for animations hook the two wires into that doesn't matter which direction because this relay even though it's DC is bi-directional meaning it'll work either way it's hooked up all it wants is um, 5 volts DC and um, I use these little five millimeter by two millimeter common um, um, quick disconnects for mine but you can wire in whatever wires you want um, to the prop and as long as you got five volts coming in and these two here so you got the one two three pins the close one and the far one are the coil they are a uh, coil or electromagnetic coil that when it gets five volts it's going to turn on the relay or close the contacts and all the relay is a switch controlled by uh, electromagnetic and um, the relay has a common contact that's hooked to the normally open or the normally closed over here but we don't need the normally closed at all and there's a normally open contact over here and what happens is when you um, close the switch or when you activate the relay it's going to close the switch and all it is is connecting the um, common here to the normally open it's going to close that so it's basically going to connect the green to the white wire here in this case and most most normal ones spirits and other other ones it's going to be the black here so um, I got a ground hook to that wire there and I'm going to hook the um, positive five I got coming from a power supply to this and you can hear the relay clicking that's the relay or electromagnetic coming in 
and over here I'm going to hook these um, two multimeter wires over here to this outside one here on the right and the center one over here and I got my multimeter on um, low ohms or continuity so when um, those switches close the relay should start beeping and show a dead short or continuity when I um, put my 5 volts to it and the relay clicks in see here the relay clicking in and I got my voltage there and the beeper showing that the um, two wires here are shorted out and that's all the fog machine needs to fully activate it is again that center pin and that switch there to close and the prop does not have enough power to do that if you hook that those two high powered um, lines coming here directly to your fog um, well not your fog your prop is it may blow the prop or at least it'll blow the um, fog activation part of the prop um, it's very low voltage coming from the prop itself that 5 volt and this is actually 120 volts um, like coming out of a house here and it's high current too um, if you got a 400 watt fog machine that's going to be a 400 watts um, that relay will handle up to uh, 10 amps so a thousand watt um, fog machine that's a little small 5 volt relay so again get yourself a little 5 volt relay and um, hook your 5 volts to the coil hook the center and right one to the um, common and normally open and that's it that's all you need to activate a, um, um, a fog machine with a um, prop hope you enjoyed bye